to my channel before today's video we are at blue water we are going to be doing some holiday shopping because we head holiday shopping on holiday on sunday and we thought we'd bring you guys along with us to do some shopping we have got to get some last minute essentials so that is the video for today we're going to bring you guys along with us go into some shops show you a haul of everything that we get at the end of it and yeah, I hope you enjoy. Make sure to smash that like button. Smash that like button. Hit the subscribe button if you haven't already. We're on the road to 80,000. We are so, so close. You guys are going to smash it. Because what do I say always? You guys are amazing. Make sure to follow me over on the social medias. I'll pop those on the screen. Now, there is so much holiday content coming. And like I said, I'm going around Sunday. So stay tuned for the holiday stuff. Go into one shop, which is obviously my favourite, Zara. And then we're going to head for lunch because I'm starving. Um, and yeah, we'll catch up with you guys. And just bring you guys along with us everything that we do so i hope you enjoy further ado let's head into the video so before we head into the video you guys know how much i love the brand skin and me and i've got some exciting news to tell you today so a quick little debrief on what skin and me is if you guys have no idea what it is i know a lot of you know that i use this and i speak very highly of it because it works wonders to the skin so skin and me is a personalized skincare brand with active ingredients that you can't just get over the counter and like i always say before this is designed by a dermatologist so you'll get an expert care without the wait time so this is called the daily doser and like i said this is completely personalized to your skin my daily doser is literally just personalized to my skin which means all of my family that own skin and me or have different ingredients to me because we all have different goals and different skin i'm going to leave the link in the description it's the consultation you guys may know the drill by now you take some makeup free photos you may say from the side from the front just so it can get like a full analysis of your skin it'll get sent off and they'll come back and recommend you with the ingredients and this will get delivered to your door every month it's a subscription service which means you can pause cancel or resume at any time it also gives you the chance every month because your skin is always changing to change your goals every month if you feel like you need to I've actually recently changed my goals because I think I had it for kind of like reduce the spots all around my face and redness but what I'm kind of experiencing now is like loads of little bubbles on my chin so I have recently updated it and this is my new one but it's so good they send you an email with everything they've changed why they're changing it why it'll be good it's just the most useful thing ever anyway skipping now to the exciting news daily defense SPF 50 sunscreen and I'm very excited that one of my favorite products in all of my makeup routine is an SPF and Skin and Me have bought one. So what I do with my SPF is I pop this on every single day and I mean every single day, SPF is so important. Pop it on under your makeup. If you're having a no makeup day, it's quick drying. Literally just chuck it on in the morning. Any UVB damage, anything like that, this item is going to help you so, so much. Where I've used mine so much, I'll pop a photo on the screen of what they look like when obviously you haven't used a lot of it. Um, I've actually got another one on its way because I want to take it on holiday with me and I feel like this won't be enough for me when I go away. A really good thing about this SPF is actually oil free as well. It protects you against the sun. It's a really good makeup primer and it will not clog your pores. I'm going to leave my code on the screen. This will get your first daily dose up for £4.99 and don't forget to try the sunscreen out too. UK based customers only. I'll leave all the links in the description all you need to know. The consultation to get a daily dose up is so quick and easy. I couldn't recommend a skincare brand enough. Go and tackle your skin goals. This thing like I say all the time is a miracle. Like skin and me could bring out anything. I absolutely adore this brand. Check out the new sunscreen. Go and grab your first daily dose if you haven't already. These products are a must have. We'll do a little outfit of the day my lens on my camera like the flippy screen is a little bit broken so i'm probably looking at the wrong bit on the camera but off-white t-shirt zara jeans what have you got CP on company t-shirt arnie jeans arnie shoes <laughs> why do you sound so weird here we are chuck the bag on the shoulder and i forgot to take the keys out of the car let's head into zara i can't possibly need anything more in zara oh my god it's quite bright today I don't possibly need anything more from Zara, but of course I'm going to have a look anyway, because why not? It's really bright, I can't really see you guys, so I'll, uh, I'll get inside and I'll take it. I forgot how loud the music is in Zara, but Harrison's in the men's section having a little look. I don't really like the buttons. No, I don't like the buttons on that. I prefer they have a white one over there. The buttons are nice. He's having a look at this little shirt for the evenings. Literally forgot how loud it is. I'm going to have to talk really loud, guys. I forgot as well I had to return something, so I've got my receipt all scrunched up. Oh, look, there's me. Harrison owns like every colour of these cargoes. I bought him these ones. I think I got him for Christmas. I think these are a new colour though, actually, because he's got the black, he's got these, but I haven't seen that colour before. Do you guys believe me if I said that I've just walked out of Zara with nothing? Absolutely nothing. Would you believe me? It's actually generally just because I feel like I actually have the whole of Zara right now and I really don't need any more stuff. Yeah, it's 
pretty bad. So I've actually just walked out with nothing. Harrison actually saw a lot of nice things, but he's gonna have a look. I can't talk. But he's gonna have a little look elsewhere to see if there's anything else as well. And then he'll go back to that stuff if he still wants it. The only thing I have done, which I should have done, is get my case out, realise what I needed to then go shopping. I haven't really looked. Oh my God, is that a bird in blue water? Do you get birds in blue water? Is that really weird or is that just you never? Birds in blue water. I did not know that. Oh, oh my God, it's just pooed. <gasps> it's just pooed on, it nearly just pooed on that lady's head. Guys, I've got to show you. Guys, I've got to show you. Look, the bird's up there. It's literally just done. I literally, could you not guys? I told you about the bird, didn't I? And then all of a sudden I just heard a splat on the floor and it done a massive poo. I've never seen a bird. Did it poo by any chance? Yeah, it did, that was so funny. Anyway, we're in Primark now. We're gonna have a little look around. We're gonna go to the girls section first or the men's. Okay. Oh, these are pretty sliders. These are actually really nice. That's quite nice as well. Yeah, I did buy that actually recently, but then I gave it to my mum because I have so many bags. I was like, do I actually need it? They have Kem's new range in Primark. But the only thing is, they just never have any sizes. Like Harrison just saw a nice top, but they have none of his size. I don't know if any boys are watching this part of the video, but these slim fit shirts never have black and white in any sizes. They have them actually today in a small, but they don't have them in a medium. They picked it up from Kem's collection. It's like this little like black over shirt. It's really nice. Very good, very nice. There you go. Look at these holiday sections in Primark. It's actually so cute, these little bags. I feel like I have so many holiday bags, you'd kill me if I got any more. It'd be really nice, my mum would love that. But I did buy a holiday hat in here the other day actually, so I don't need another one. Loads of colour in Primark. Loads and loads of colour. This is actually a really cute bag, isn't it, Harrison? It's gold. It has, I just don't actually think I need any more bags. It's £14. I actually think that's really cute. And it's massive as well. Not like massive as in... No, I don't actually need another bag, but it's really spacious in there. They've got loads of them in Primark. Oh, they've got it in like a bluey colour, but I think I prefer this. Please say they have H. <laughs> they never, ever, ever, ever have H. Come on, moment of truth. No. Come to you next. Because Harrison wants to get some clothes. <laughs> oh, that is proper dad vibes, isn't it? When they have a belt like that. That's what my dad wears. <laughs> well, he used to, like ones like this with the belt across them. Anyone can relate to that? Harrison, you could wear some funky trunks on holiday. <laughs> you could wear something like this, couldn't you guys? Or like that, you know, bright, go bright or go home. It's not even a saying, but I've made one up now. Harrison, I actually think you could rock that look. <laughs> look at that. It's like going and grab a shower gel for holiday over there. When Erin and Brandon were in Dubai, they got me a couple of candles and room sprays. <gasps> I need to pay Erin for that. I haven't even paid her for that yet. I need to bring her now and ask her how much that was. Well, I'm going to go and bring Erin and find out how much I owe her. Because I feel bad. Isn't it the worst thing when you forget to give someone the money and you feel like they don't want to text you because they're being rude and like asking for it, but then like I should be the one actually saying like, I owe you something, but I forgot. I hate it when that happens. But I'm going to ring her now and find out how much I owe her. Erin and Brandon bought me back from Dubai. I don't think they do them in the UK. They were room sprays, but this is a new one, like Among the Clouds. Oh, they have got a shower gel for this. Maybe I should smell this one. Oh, wow. People get this one, guys. Oh, I can smell it, H. Hmm. What, for holiday? Yeah, it's eight pound, which is actually quite pricey, isn't it? Always make my body so soft, ladies. Okay, we're gonna grab the new one among the clouds. We're gonna take this one away with us because it smells incredible. Here we made it to Wagamama's. Oh my god, have they changed their menus? Or have I just never seen that part before? I don't know. Um, but we're just sat here. Harrison, what are you gonna eat? What do you think I'm gonna eat? Katsu curry. I don't know what I get. Oh, it's this. Yaki soba I said earlier, didn't I? That was not the right thing. I meant the teriyaki soba with steak. That is what I get and it's so nice. I posted a TikTok. I don't think you guys have seen my holiday nails, but this is my own nails. I have put them everywhere, obviously, but YouTube, but these are my actual nails. I was going for like a bio journey. It's been like three months, I think. And that is my natural nails. I know you can't really see. 
my natural nails. So that's what we went for for holiday. Like a little evil eye. It absorbs negative energy and it looks after you. So I did mention in my last video, I didn't know that I was going to get my nails done. And I did go for the evil eye. It matches my little ring as well that I have on my hand. I can't really see it. Oh yeah, you can. It matches my little ring. But I never actually thought these would be my real nails. But they are. Um, yeah, I've got to tell you. A little update on the nails that I did go for. I did go for them. Right, mine has come. Looks so yummy. Look at all that steak. So good. What are you doing? What is that? A noodle. <laughs> no? No, okay. Harrison's hasn't come yet, but guys, I can't wait. I need to eat. I'm starving. It's half one, actually. Right. So we're eating quite late. Yeah, look at that, guys. That steak does look good. Does look good? Are you jealous? Right. You got food envy? No. Yeah. What is that? What do you mean? What is that? It's so fussy, guys. That's it's a bit of like noodles, steak, That's noodle. That's like, sauce. Like a vegetable, yeah, like bean sprouts. That's a bean sprout. Oh, <laughs> right, I'm gonna eat the noodles. How stop being so fussy? Just try it. That was a pathetic bite. Yeah, no. No. <laughs> oh, you're so dramatic. Right, anyway, I'm going to tuck into mine. Harrison got a katsu curry, so you guys will know what that'll look like anyway. But I'm going to tuck in because this looks unbelievable. This is what a real meal looks like. The shadow. A nice, basic meal in Wagamama's. Harrison, Harrison just tried some of my steak, guys. The minute I turn the camera off, Let's Harrison... Let's get some food set, mate. The minute I turn the camera off, Harrison food Wow. Came. <laughs> I do love that. But I think I like this a little bit more at the minute. Because everyone goes, oh, you're so basic. I'm like, no, I just really like this. Yeah. Okay, we're going to tuck in because we are hungry. <laughs> Guys, we absolutely smashed it. Sweet one. Did you like it? Lovely, thanks. That was really good. It's my favourite thing for my mamas at the minute. I do love a katsu curry, but that's slightly top set at the minute. So we're going to go to some more shops. Oh, H&M. I want to go to Bay Avenue because I loved their bikinis last summer and I want to see if oh, there's any one in. Oh, I love this lady. If you ever go to the Blue Water one, look out for her. She's so lovely, so helpful. They're all so lovely in there as well though. Um, but she's so sweet. So I'm going to have a little look in there. And I don't really know if I need to go anywhere else. Really. I think I might go to Superdrug for some sun cream. I need to double check with my dad how much because he did buy one for me when because he's going away as well. So he did buy me some when he went. I'm not sure if it's enough for both of us. So. Yeah, we're going to head to a few more shops and like I always say, we'll keep you updated with what we get up to. We're in H&M, the music again. Hello. <laughs> it's really, really loud. But he's picked up, kind of show the camera briefly what it is. This little, little top. Um, I've never been to the H&M men's section before, ever. Um, but it's actually really nice. H&M complete. Harrison got quite a few bits. I just grabbed some relaxed cotton shorts, they were called, um, for the daytime in Malta for like walking around, doing a little bit of sightseeing. So I just got some comfy shorts because I don't actually think I have enough comfy shorts. I have like just, what are they called? I like, don't know, like denim. I need to get a pair of denim shorts before I go today. Um, left or right, we need to go this way. We're going to head. Boots. What do you need in boots? Sun cream. Good idea. We'll go to boots, grab some sun cream. I'm just gonna get some last little bits now, really. Um, I feel like my camera's always blurry, but it doesn't look blurry, but I'm always so conscious of my camera lens being blurry. Um, but we're gonna grab some sun cream. There it is, as soon as you walk in, you can tell summer's coming. All the sun cream is right in front of us, but I think you prefer the spray ones, don't you, Harrison? I'm a sun care miss, that's quite good. Sun care. Sun care lotion. Yeah, these, these ones are actually really good. I, I've had these before. These, This one's really good. I think we should get this one. Just come into Aldo, and I think I want to try these on. They're so nice. They're these brown, like, slides. And we've got them in black. I've got some really nice, like, little colourful ones. I got, I bought loads last summer from here. They're, like, the nicest places for, like, slide-on little, some little slide-on little shoes. They're actually really comfy, guys, but I actually think I need a size bigger. My feet are ridiculous. They just never fit in sandals. I always think I need a size up. No, didn't look great. 
they just my feet are just too wide these ones that i have on now they're like perfect because they cover my feet but then ones they just don't always look great um they're a bit hit and miss that's why i always try them on but i've gone into bar avenue now so i'm in the bar avenue changing rooms my favorite lady was here paula if you're watching this <laughs> i'm just trying on these and um, bikinis. Did I wear these two to Marbella for when well, we surprised Casey? I wore this one in blue, so I've picked it up in black and red. So come in here to get some bikinis. She's honestly the most helpful lady in the world. Make sure you love her. But we're gonna try these on now and see what they look like. Red bikini was lovely. I did need another black bikini because I have had loads of black bikinis before, but the red one was really nice. And now I'm just stopping it out. I'm stopping out. I'm stopping at Joe and the Juice to get my favourite, which is the Iron Man. Literally, my favourite thing in the world. Harrison, are you tired now? Shut up. Harrison can't shop for long. He likes to be in and out. Six quid. That is quite a lot of money. It's quite expensive for what it is, I think. But I can't help but get it because I just love it. Well, we're going to head to Accessorize, our last shop. And then we're gonna go home and give you all a big fat haul on what we got. So, ladies and gents, I am back from Blue Water. Harris has had to nip out, so I'm gonna give you the haul of this video by myself because he's not here and he's not back till later on. So, I'm gonna film it now. Start with H&M, and I bought these little. These were the shorts that I was talking about. Um, so when we go to Malta, we're doing a little bit of like sightseeing um, and things like that because I've never been before either. Um, so there's a bit of walking involved. So I thought I could just wear these relaxed little shorts and they've got pockets just for like in the daytime tucking another little vest into them um and i just thought they're just really handy so hopefully they fit because i didn't try them on harrison picked up these like little gray shorts again literally just for like walking around in it's nice and easy also picked this little top up from h&m you can't really see it but it's like that like, towel material and then it has a pocket on the front there this is from the chem collection at primark it's this little top again like you can't really see it um because of the lighting hello pepper um but it's this little like um shirt it's really nice actually plain white t-shirts in next because that boy has so many t-shirts but he's convinced that he needs more every time he goes shopping head on the camera that we was in boots so we done like the three for two i think it was yeah it was the three for two and all the mini bits so i got myself one of these for holiday i just find them so much easier the little travel ones and they don't take up a lot of room i don't take this to actually remove my makeup i kind of just take them like if i need them um kind of thing because i use um cleansing balm and then we got a sun cream to share we bought a aftercare aftercare after sun I don't know where I got aftercare from, after sun. And then we actually bought these little minis as well. This one was, a, it was a really good idea Harrison came up with. Was obviously like when we're walking around in the day, doing a bit of like the sightseeing, it's taking a mini sun cream with us so we don't have to take the big one in our bag. So we can keep topping it up. So we've got a mini one. Harrison got a Feel Awake Rodox like little mini shower gel. And then we got two toothpaste because, <laughs> and then we got two toothpaste because we're both gonna take one with us. And then I bought from Primark. I always grab these before I go away. They're the squeezable travel bottle sets. It was actually only a pound. Um, I used this one for my cleansing balm, so I squirt my cleansing balm into that. Um, and then I use that for like face wash. I just use these all the time whenever I go away. So always an essential. And then in Bow Avenue, I bought a new bikini. So it is the one that I wore, um, like I said earlier, in the Marbella um, video that I made. When we went to surprise Casey, I bought this in like a dark blue. Um, but I bought it in the red colour because I really love the way these fit. And then also bought the matching red bottoms. I just loved it on. Went and tried it on. My favourite Paula was there to help me. Absolutely loved the red colour. It looked really, really nice on. I did make a spontaneous purchase. I did buy some new trainers. It all stemmed from I wear Converse to the gym. So when I do like weight training, obviously it's good to be like leveled with the with the ground floor. So Converse are always known for being really flat. Um, but I've started spin classes and um, I went last week. It was so hard, but it was so good. Um, and the lady said like Converse is literally the worst shoes for this class. And I kind of realized that after like the pain when you're stepping on the spin or like the um, the bike is so painful. She said you like you need more of a platform shoe, but I needed new gym shoes anyway. When we go to Malta, we're doing a lot of walking. So I needed new shoes. So it was just an excuse really for me to buy new shoes and they'll be good for my spin class. Um, so I bought 
these gym trainers and I've seen them in JD so many times but I've never actually picked them up and I just thought you know Peppa and I thought you know what I'm just gonna grab them because I'm literally always gonna wear them I just cannot get them dirty but they are so pretty I literally love them I don't know what they actually are what well, I don't actually know what they are. Oh, Air Max 270s. Oh, they're 270s. Um, I don't know. I just think they're really good. And they're really good for my spin classes as well now. So I'll have a comfy foot while I do the class. I'll quickly show you. So I tried this on in my local Zara a few days ago. And they didn't have it in a smaller size. But I absolutely love this for holiday. It is stunning. So it's this white dress. And it has a cutout across the stomach. Oh my god. I just absolutely loved it. The code for this, if anyone wants to have a look, is 2712 slash 022 slash 250. It was £22. I absolutely loved it on, but it, I only had, but they only had a medium and it was just a little bit too big. I have finished it and yeah, that's everything that we bought today. I hope you enjoy just coming in along with us, doing a bit of shopping with us. I love filming videos like this because I feel like we're all together and literally whatever we get up to, you guys are here with us, literally on a camera and I love it. But next week, I did sneak peek what this video would be, my next one. Um, so yeah, stay tuned for that and then the one after that as well you may guess what it could be um so yeah stay tuned for the next couple of weeks always good videos but these ones are going to be even better <laughs> than normal because it's holiday related maybe um but yeah i love you all so so much just before we end the video just a quick reminder i'm going to re-put my code on the screen now pat 99 you're getting your first ever daily doser and the free trial of the new sunscreen let me know if you have already got the daily doser let me know how you get on with the sunscreen or if you haven't tried any of them and this is going to be your first time let me know head into the description and go and try out these must-haves and i will see you guys with another exciting video tuesday 6 p.m bye